Hello Lolas, welcome back to my channel guys. If you're new to this channel, go ahead and smash that subscribe button. Click the bell to be a part of the notification squad. And if you want to be a Chatterbox member, you can join by clicking the link in the description bar. It is $1.99 to join. I do uh, share some behind the scenes, um, little stuff of me as who I am outside of dolls and well, I don't know. It's a little bit of my personal and a little bit of the and a lot of the doll stuff or whatever the case may be. Either way it go, this is Baby Jersey and Baby Jersey is my little pickle. And um, so he was painted by uh, Asha from Pickles and Tea. And I am going to um, actually attempt to reweight him. I have not been able to do it. Um, because I just didn't want to take him apart <laughs> and I'm also going to dress him if I have time. Oh yeah, I did bring a diaper. I was like, I didn't bring a diaper. Okay, I got to try to stay out of the, the uh, camera because I got on my little skimpy pajamas. <laughs> so, um, but yeah. So, he is the Jude Sculpt by Oka R. And so, and I named him Jersey. And so, um. Asha did weight him nice. I just, you know, I have my particular way of weighting him. Plus, I need to put the zip ties on anyway. So, I am going to do that. Um, I am not going to put any more weight in his limbs. I'm just going to um, his, uh, put some more weight in his head and maybe a little bit in his chest area. Um because that's what I do <laughs> and um one thing I, I I always say I be like oh he's on strings but I do want to say this um he is on strings and they are tight I cannot put I don't know why I don't know why I cannot do the strings every time I use the strings little arms and legs just be falling off <laughs> so I don't do well at that and yes he's a baldy I am going to get him rooted at some point just not right now I'm not in a rush to get him rooted but I am going to get him some black rooted hair um maybe sometime next year I'll get it done, but he is super cute as a hat baby, and I don't know, I just, I, I don't have a, I guess because a lot of my reborns are usually bald anyway, <laughs> I don't usually have that much of a problem. Now, I was going to change his, um, his diaper, but I kind of like this diaper, so I might put this one back on him after he gets his body changed. All right. I love the body that she used on him. Um, I think I, I mentioned that before. I think we both ended up um, switching the bodies out. Now, he has some weight in here. Um, I'm going to go ahead and fill up my stocking. So I use this stocking. And each one of these things equals represents a pound so even without putting a baby on a scale you can kind of guess not considering the vinyl and the cloth and the, the feel how much a baby is going to weigh just by how many bags of these you use and I did I, I thought I wasn't going to need my scissors but it looks like I am do I even have them in here yes <laughs> okay so I'm going to clip this so I just clip this like this way and you know this is something that you guys should definitely always have. Bountiful Baby sells everything you need for waiting your babies. So I use these zip ties and I use stockings from Bountiful Baby. I like them because they're thick and the beads don't come through and you don't have to double them up and also polyfill you can buy also from bountiful baby and like walmart like seriously i buy like really big bags from walmart and then i also um so i'll just 
pour this in. I also use bags um, of polyfill, the, the, the soft kind from the cluster fluff from um, Balance for Baby, which I need to order some more in my next order because I think I'm probably out because I went to look for some just now and I couldn't find it. So, all right. Ooh, this is heavy. So I usually like a weight, like depending on the baby size, but I'm gonna use this whole thing for his body. So, and then I'm gonna tie it in a knot. That's usually what I do. I think he has wafers in him. I'm getting to the point where I kind of like my wafers. So let me see. Sometime if I'm putting a wafer in, I'll put it inside the stocking. But let me see if I got some wafers right here. If I got some wafers here, I might actually add another wafer in him. But I don't think I have any right here. I usually have them because when I buy my hair, the ladies usually put them in there, but that's okay. So, all right, so we got that. So his head, <laughs> I'm thinking I'm gonna make another sack for his head. Now, I'm probably not going to make this as heavy. I don't know. Yes, I am. I usually use, like, at least one full sack in the head. Because I like my heads to have weight so they can really fall. So, when the heads are really heavy, they fall better. So, I'm going to pour this in here. I hope everybody is having a good time and enjoying your babies i have been really enjoying my babies like i have gotten off track with some of the babies that i was supposed to be completing um i'm doing something very crazy right now i'm really <gasps> oh see 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 this is what i don't like <laughs> this is where i get beads like oh crap here take this but um I'm um, see I was talking about about to say something but um I'm working off of very raw emotions right now come here baby come here this is why I be having a um back in my floor regularly because I, I stopped waiting my babies in this room actually because of that because I will drop or in the beds because I will get the beads on them he actually feels really good like I had him like laying like this in my arm he feels he actually his weight like he 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 wiggles quite a bit but I think he's gonna wiggle a lot more once I tweak him just a little bit so let me see and sometimes it takes me knowing what is actually in inside of them. All right. So she tied this in a knot. Ah, man, it's like super tied. It's pretty cool. I don't know what the heck I'm doing. I'm hoping this will help. <laughs> it probably made it worse. No. Yeah, it did. Okay, that didn't work out. Let's see. Wow. That's so cool. Okay. Guys, I don't know how to do this. I don't know how to take these off. Because the way she tied them is so tight. So let me tell you. Although she used string... Look at this. Look how hard it is to get that off. It's very durable. The girl know what she's doing. Not that I doubt it that she did, but just saying. Just am. <laughs> like, how am I going to get this? Uh, see, with the zip ties, I would just clip. So I'm trying to find 
the actual start of this. <sighs> this is not my ideal situation here. Let me see if I can get underneath and I don't want to I don't want to scratch this paint, so I want to be very careful. And I don't want to clip the body. So, I'm trying. Oh, this is very, very different. Wow. Yeah. Well, first of all, let me say this. <laughs> she must be used reinforce the string because I've never seen that much string on the top, the regular ties. Wow. See how I, I get yeah, I get frustrated quick. I'll be done toward like for me, I'll be done like rip the body and put a whole nother body on. That's me. I, I am not the one for patience. All right, let's see. All right. Yeah, because like it's in a knot. And so. All right, so. I want this off so I can put zip ties, but. This is, that's, yeah, that's firm. All right. So. Ah. I like those. I used to use those. I mean, I used to use them. I had a reborn, I mean, a silicone baby that had those in it. It's like those steel pellets type thing which is nice they're sparkling <laughs> yeah okay all right so I am going to slide this in and then I want to replace it with my polyfill I, I gotta take these arms off so I'm sorry I can't I can't Sorry guys. I wanna not stop the camera to do it because I don't feel like having to piece the 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 thing together. But oh well, I'll just leave it. Hopefully I didn't yeah. That's pretty much still intact, so I'ma just leave it because I can't even take it apart. That's that. <laughs> All right. And the reason why I wanted to do the zip ties because I can pull it closer to the body like this versus it like kind of gapping a little bit right there. But that's okay. I'm going to just leave it as B because the girl got it on super tight so at least I know I always was worried because it'll kind of like show right there that it might fall off but it ain't gonna fall off and this should let other mommies know they get babies from her that the babies are secure all right so this take this out I learned too that certain certain materials you can use a lot of it but it don't get as heavy as some 
others. So let's see how we work this out. All right. So, all right. So she, I had nice weight, which is still good weight. I might actually should have put that in the chest. But I'm going to put, I'm going to still use this polyfill in here because it don't matter if it's soft or not. Because this is just to So normally, I will take this and I will decide if I want the beads to go towards the front of the face, which way I want the head to fall or the back, if I want it to fall back more. In this case, he's fairly little, so I want his head to fall forward. So I'm going to put the weight of the uh, beads more towards the front of his head. Um, German vinyl seemed to be a lot heavier than the other vinyl, so the baby already kind of have a little bit more weight than it would have if it was regular vinyl. So, I am, sorry, I'm stuffing this in and sometime I'll take this and put it in first that way but this way I'm gonna do it this way because I can easily grab it and start pulling it out when I get ready to send him to be rooted so and then I plug it with this now I sometimes use plugs you don't have to people use this that's fine but sometimes I do use plugs now I'm going to actually use a zip tie. Oh, his head is heavy now. <laughs> um, I'm actually going to give him back his beads that she gave. Give him back his beads. And I'm just going to put a little bit of stuff in. And if you make the chest a little bit loose, it will allow it will allow him to have a little bit more flop. So, and I'll pick them up and move them around to see if that how it feels. Okay. All right. So now you want to have it going in so that these can come around like that. So this can go inside there. So I am going to slide this in this way. And I know some of you guys are probably like, why well, go through all of that though? Oh my God, this video is super long. Oh well. Sometimes this junk is harder to do on camera. And some of these bodies, when they have that little side opening, is aggravating too. of this it's right here it's like okay okay so I'll kind of go ahead and push this in just so I'll have something to pull right there so I kind of push it in a little bit right there just so I can have something to grab onto so 
kind of tighten it up a little bit right there and then I want to I want to make sure it's in that groove so, so and then I want to make sure he can still turn his head and also it can fall without being open okay all right and then that's when I use this so you guys didn't get to see the full but I do have a video of me doing all the zip ties and all that and stuff um so I clip it really close so there's no leftover there all right there we go let me hold it yeah see he has more weight now I like my babies like heavy and I like that like when they can like like they ball into like fall like poop. okay so I may eventually take the time to really get those zip ties off though I mean those ties off I put zip ties because now I feel defeated I'm gonna put his white diaper on just because so I'll just put this on him And sometimes if you don't want to do the, um, you could spray like the baby spray on the actual cloth. But I prefer to just use the wipers if you want. Or you could put it in the diaper. If you don't want it to be like a permanent, permanent situation. Which over time it will die down anyway. Should have put him on a onesie underneath, but that's okay. That's okay, say that's okay. All right. So there we go. So I feel so much better with him having the weight, a little bit more weight, and he, like I said, he didn't need much more. But when I pick him up, he'll he'll have more of a heavy feel. So that is it. <laughs> that was a lot. So I'll take this polyfill and I'll use it. I'll put it in my bin and I'll use it like this. I'll use it for like inside the heads and stuff. All right. So mission complete. <laughs> See you guys later. Thanks for watching.